Well, gentlemen, coat two. Did a little more up here on the sides and on the center. Did those, got those cleaned out. And red guarded those in. There. Ended down here, you can see over here, down there. And this wall were last, that's why they're pink. And that wall back there is mostly red. All right, I'm really happy with how this is turning out. Um, that decoupling tape or seam tape worked really good. I wasn't actually planning on doing these sides. I was just going to do the seam down here and the seam up there. And up there, I really was only going to do the middle, but I had so much. I didn't go all the way to the ceiling, but I had so much left over. Look, I even went too far down there. I'm going to trim that off. That one looks better. And I still got, oh, I'd say three quarters of a bucket. So probably two more coats. That definitely gets two more. And the walls might too. I mean, I bought it. It's 50 bucks a gallon. I bet you I use it. And out here it's just dry, so you don't really need it. Not to mention out here it's It's glazed tile for the, for the walls, and I'm not doing grout lines, they're just getting sealed with caulk in between. So no water should be able to penetrate that and be sealed down to the floor too. I almost put that in, which would have been a mistake. I've got to trim the bottom of all those walls, however much I have to trim off up here, whatever that comes out to, you can see it tapers down. So I'll have to get the laser in here, put those two in after the floor and then get the laser in here and mark where my grout line needs to go all the way around it. Well, I say grout line, my caulk line. But it's getting there dudes. I think tomorrow, tomorrow morning I'm going to start on this floor and probably grout. After, it, after this one's good to grout, I'll grout it. Maybe Sunday I may seal it to it's gonna get a flat sealer. But alright, there's today's update. Enjoy fellas.